question four. Now the easiest thing to do here is just to draw yourself a triangle. And let's just label some points on the triangle. So let's call that A, that's B. It's talking about a right angle triangle. So let's just imagine I've drawn myself a right angle triangle there. So it says B to C is four, A to B is seven. Now the best thing that we can do here is again just pretend this is a right angle triangle and just work out what this side is meant to be but we actually know what it is because we're told the perimeter is 20 we know the other two sides are 11 so therefore the answer is this should side should be 9 but if it's a right angle triangle let's find out what it is so let's use our Pythagoras so 4 squared is 16 7 squared is 49. So if we add these bits together, we get 65. We take the square root of that. So is that equal to 9? No, it's not. It's not equal to 9. So therefore, it's not a right angle. So it cannot be a right angled triangle because Pythagoras doesn't work.